I need to ask you about all the rumors going around. <laughs> what rumors? You know, the ones saying you dated Candace LeRae before she married Johnny Gargano. Are they true? There might be some truth to it all. Well, whether it's true or not, Johnny Gargano is coming after your NXT championship, and leaning into the rumors might be a good way to play some mind games with him. Just a suggestion. I think you're onto something here. Want to help me out with all this? I'd love to. But if I'm going to do this, I need you to use your pull and get me a shot at the NXT Women's Championship. No problem. This is going to be so much fun. We've been waiting all week to hear this major announcement from the NXT Champion, so let's find out what he has to say. There's been a lot of rumors and innuendo going around social media the past few weeks, so I'm here tonight to set the record straight. My big announcement is that everything you read is true. I was, in fact, romantically involved with Candice LeRae before she married Johnny Gargano. That's right, she was mine before she was his. It all started in 2015 when Johnny Gargano had just signed with NXT. He put every ounce of his time and energy into making it here and becoming the Johnny Wrestling that you know today. But to achieve all that, he ended up spending more time with his tag partner Tommaso Ciampa than his romantic partner Candice LeRae. Candice was lonely <laughs> and things got worse when her boyfriend didn't have the guts to ask NXT management to consider signing her too. She started to think that maybe he was intentionally holding her back, scared that if she got a chance in NXT, she would outshine him. Nonetheless, she needed a shoulder to cry on, and that shoulder was mine. We dated for a bit and it was okay, but then I got bored and broke things off. And that's when she went crawling back to John. They ended up getting engaged and <laughs> the rest is history. So that's right, Johnny. Everything you've seen and heard is true. Your wife is a fake. And if you or anyone else doesn't believe any of this, that's okay. Because I have proof of every conversation, every late night text, every DM. It's every Johnny call. Gargano. He heard enough. And Gargano's taking it to the NXT champion. Can you blame him after everything that the champion said? Well, we don't know what's true or not, but one thing's apparent. Johnny Gargano is extremely upset. We know these are lies, and so does Gargano. That's why he's so angry. The NXT champion clearly wants no part of this. Happy to stir the pot and then run away. He's not running away. He was attacked. You expect him to stand there and take that? I don't know what to expect, but hopefully we get to the bottom of all this sooner rather than later. champion looks to be in complete control of this match despite all the outside noise he's locked in tonight it's johnny gargano and he's all over the champion gargano's lost it wouldn't you after everything the champion has said about candace LeRae? speaking of candace it looks like she's here too and she didn't come empty-handed Candice LeRae is going to get some revenge on the champion for all the lies and disparaging remarks how do you know they're lies Wait, what is Dakota Kai doing here? Well, apparently she sided with the champion in all this. Dakota nails Candice with a chair. Low blow to Gargano. I can't believe these two are working together. DDT under the chair. 
We've seen Dakota Kai chime in on the champion's claims on social media, but now she just took her support to a whole new level. I don't know about anyone else, but I'd really like some answers right now. Whether there's any truth to all this or it's simply just mind games from the champion, it's certainly taking a toll on NXT's first couple. Gargano's in a crisis here. Bulldog! And that'll finally do it. What a victory. Here are your winners, the King and Dakota Khan. Now we know who the better man and woman are. What a mixed tag match. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice. And the NXT champion takes control. Irish whipping Gargano into his corner. Hold on, it looks like Dakota Kai is trying to remove the opposite turnbuckle pad. Uh, maybe she's fixing it. Luckily, the referee Sarn will put an end to this cheating immediately. Speaking of cheating, Candice LeRae now getting involved. Candice LeRae with the jawbreaker. And Gargano nails the super kick. We have a new NXT champion. Johnny Gargano has done it again. What a moment after all he's been through. But it didn't happen without some level of controversy. Gargano's wife, Candice LeRae, now handing him the NXT championship. And that's exactly what she did when she got involved in the match. Dakota Kai would have done the exact same thing or worse. It doesn't take anything away from Gargano's win. The former champion from behind. And Candice gets sent flying off the apron. She hit pretty hard. And suddenly for Johnny Gargano, jubilation turns to concern for his wife. We all just hope she's okay. Maybe we do, but the now former champion looks content to have gotten some form of payback on the first couple of NXT, intentional or not. I have a feeling this is far from over between these three. And now he's giving you new champion. I can't believe it. Here is your winner and the new NXT champion, the King. A night and title change we will all remember for a very long time. The now former champion obviously not happy with this outcome. I did not think a title change was in the cards here tonight.